Hi, I'm Rick. This is You Can Cook. And today I'm going to show you just how easy it is to cook a pot of rice. Stay tuned. Seriously, how hard could it possibly be to cook a pot of rice? Some people, there's no problem whatsoever. You may have a rice cooker, although if you have a rice cooker, you have to buy that rice cooker. Over the years, I've seen people make it more complicated than it has to be. Cooking rice is so simple. I learned this when I was about 16 or 17 years old from my aunt Chucko. She was a Japanese lady married to my uncle. I've cooked rice this way ever since then, and I've never changed it. Now, cooking rice really is getting the rice to absorb water so that you can eat it. Technically speaking, you can get rice to absorb in cold water. It just takes a lot, lot longer. The reason we use heat is because it speeds up the process immensely. Now, all I do is I add one part rice to two parts moisture. So it doesn't matter what the amounts are. One part rice, two parts water. So I put my rice in. <clears throat> That's one cup because there's only the two of us. So two cups of water. And I put in a pinch of salt. I put this on my smallest burner and I bring it up to the point of where it's just about to boil. And then I put the lid on, turn it down to as low as I can possibly go. And I time it for 18 minutes exactly. Never pick up the lid. I just time it for 18 minutes and I have perfect rice. And it's, done, and it's worked for me this way for about 40 years, 45 years. I have perfect rice every time. If I want my rice wetter, I just cook it a little less time, down to 15 or 16 minutes, and I've got wet rice. Now, obviously, everyone, this is just for the basic white rice. You cook brown rice a bit differently, and obviously, boreal rice, okay, goes without speaking. But this is just for this kind of rice. I use basmati most of the time. You can use jasmine, there's long grain, all kinds of stuff out there that you can use. Okay, that's it. That's how hard it is. Put your ingredients in, bring it up to just before it boils, 18 minutes, done. This has come straight off the stove to show you, whether you believe it or not, that it works out perfectly every single time. And all I'm going to do is just, it'll fluff up as I take it out of the, the pan here. Nice. No crusty bottom. <laughs> okay, that was an accident. And that's stuck. Oh, no. And look, guys, all I do, look. Depending on what. I'm making, if I'm not like, for example, uh, an Indian dish, uh, I'll probably put some, um, what do you call that little red thing? Oh gosh. Ah! <laughs> ah! I can't think of it. Anyway, it could, for 45 years I've cooked rice that way. It's super easy. It's fast, apart from the, the 18 minutes that it actually has to absorb the water. It's foolproof. You can't mess that up. If that messes up, your, your heat is too high, uh, you're doing something wrong, not enough water, too much water. Okay, it works perfectly every single time. I'm Rick Bichelle. Make sure you subscribe because I'm going to come up with lots of stuff just like this. Well, better than this. This was <laughs> cooking rice isn't much. It doesn't t take rocket science to figure out how to cook rice. But look, subscribe right here. You'll be notified of upcoming stuff. I've got so much stuff coming up, and I actually have something coming up that you're really going to like. I'm Rick Michelle. This is You Can Cook. So long for now, everyone.